Mobile is really the most recent thing that's made a big impact because Google used to look first at our desktop factors. So what was going on on our desktop in order to figure out what, how they were going to rank us. Recently, within the last year, they have slowly started rolling out mobile first rankings. And so they're basically saying, okay, we're going to look first at the ranking factors for mobile. So what are you doing on mobile, on your mobile site, whether that's a responsive site or a separate mobile experience or no mobile experience at all. And they're going to be ranking every search, both desktop and search based on those mobile experiences. Voice, the things that we can do for it now, they're sort of limited because we don't have a lot of measurement for voice. It's not separated out in our Google Analytics. We don't have those things. So what we have to look at is these proxy metrics, which nobody really likes, but they're there and it's kind of what we're stuck with right now. We have spent a lot of time as an industry using clicks and traffic as a metric for success. And we've called other things vanity metrics, but I think clicks and traffic are vanity metrics. Ultimately, the only real metric is ROI. What money are you making from this? Just because you don't get a click doesn't mean you're not building influence. Doesn't mean that somebody doesn't see you as that source where that content came from. So what if they get their answer right there? It's really hard to sort of track that success back to um, that time that you showed up in the answer box, but ultimately it builds influence and it makes people more likely to search you out as a brand in the future. I kind of think we're going to have to shift majorly as a marketing industry to say, you know, we're going to lose clicks and that's okay because we're building influence and that's what's mo most important. One of the things with SEO is making sure that people stay and engage with your content and don't leave and go back to the search engine results page and click to somebody else. Google's tracking that type of behavior. They know when people aren't satisfied with the content that they get on your page. Even though it's not a direct ranking factor, it influences a ranking factor that um, can really make a difference for your content and your rankings.